Hello guys, Joseph here. So, many of you know me because we grew up together or we've worked together or maybe this video is finding you on Facebook and some of you that may have just subscribed to the channel never seen this face, heard this voice before. This video is a, is a declaration video to, to the world. Okay, so if you guys don't know me and I say all this very humbly, I'm nothing, I'm nothing special. I'm just another human being that has some, what I feel, useful and powerful messages for humanity as a whole to hopefully bring about more peace and harmony throughout the world and eliminate as much suffering as humanly possible. So if you don't know me, um, I lived a pretty regular life in Pennsylvania, but then I, I set upon this very powerful spiritual journey about two and a half years ago, starting with, with ayahuasca. It led me all the way down to Peru. It's led me to ceremonies in different places. And with each subsequent ceremony, I was not only lifting away traumas and pains and, and stuff that was holding me back in my own life, my body, my soul, but also tapping into to God, to, to Jesus, to the spiritual realm and the ways in which God has intended for us to live by, which I think have been so lost, especially in our modern, very distracted culture that we exist in now today. So what I want to tell you guys is that um, evil is real. The forces of evil are real. This is not something out of a fantasy movie. I'm sorry, there's a lot of background noise. I'm currently in Lima, Peru. It's a very large metropolitan city in South America, and it's just constant noise. There's like 10 million plus people here. Anyway, evil is real. Okay, I'm not sure if you went to church when you grew up, what movies you saw, what religion you follow, what your faith is like, but evil is real. There are forces out there that are outside of our physical, material, 3D world that are trying to harm us, that are trying to hurt us, that are trying to corrupt us, that are trying to undo all the beauty that God has intended for us. God wants us to live within love and harmony amongst each other. It was the way that was intended, but the other one, whatever you call him or it, evil one, Satan, Lucifer, um, demons, etc. And I'm still trying to figure out where they come from, but they exist and they are trying to hurt us. Okay? The devil uses a lot of different ways to keep us separate from each other. And when you really start to learn how to look, you can see it as clear as day. The one area that the devil cannot operate in is the light. Jesus Christ, if you've probably heard this about him, is the truth, the light, and the way, the protector. That's why people say, Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior. He is the light that's coming through God that is basically protecting you from the darkness and all the different trickery that the devil applies to try to make you be fearful, doubtful of yourself, to make you reject others, to make you afraid of others, etc. Now I can declare to you guys now more than ever that I am fully rooted in the light and love of God and Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior and I believe in Him, in Him so fully. Okay, this video is not to try to sway you to one religion or not, but if you've been experiencing things in your life that are bringing you down, you can't seem to just get out of this pit, you're miserable, you're suffering, things just aren't working out, maybe it's time to start praying. Maybe it's time to ask God and Jesus into your life, into your heart, and just ask, Jesus, I, I don't know you, but I'd like to know you. I welcome you into my heart. Please show me the way. Please show me you're there. And just pray. And I guarantee you, eventually, when the timing is right, because God's timing is always right, you will have the answers and they will come and help you. Okay? So I don't want to make this video too long, but these are some of the truths that, you know, were kind of impressed upon me while going through Catholic Mass and while altar serving and, you know, reading other books and the Bible and YouTube videos and talking to people and blah, 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 blah. But it's been fully realized with the assistance of these messengers from Mother Earth being sacred plant medicine. Ayahuasca, mushrooms as well, um, uh, wachuma, you know, it's uh, basically cactus juice in the Peruvian sacred valley. There's many ways to get there, but if you're not feeling love and happiness in your life, there are other ways to get there, okay? Stop seeking the temptation. Stop trying to fill yourself up with more food, more alcohol, more TV, more pornography, more pleasure, blah, 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 because it's not there. You'll never 
you'll never be fully satiated and satisfied with those things, okay? We need to be rooted in the light and love that God has intended for us. Intended for us. I love you guys so much. I'm going to upload this whenever. If you have comments, please leave them about your, your personal stories and maybe what you're struggling with and if you found God or not. And then, of course, please, if this kind of stuff interests you, if you want to hear more about, you know, um, my wacky adventures and just being a truth seeker, please subscribe to the channel and give the video a like. I love you guys. I'll talk to you soon.